Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This will be part two of my Bantu knot tutorial. So at this point, I've had this hairdo now for two days. Um, I was going to wear it until tomorrow in the knots, but I probably wear it until tomorrow. But I'm going to probably take one more down just so you guys can see exactly what they look like when they come down. Which one, though? I don't know. I'm probably not going to take any more down. But I've been taking a couple down. As you can see how it comes out. And this is one of my favorite go-to natural styles. Bantu knot. Um... It really trains your hair, keeps it separated, get the nutrients it can get. I've clipped the ends on these, by the way. So what I usually do is once I unravel one, I guess I can do, that's going to look weird. I'm trying to pick which one I could do and then not be looking so crazy. Um... So basically, I unravel them like that. Because some people always ask me, how do I unravel them so perfect without messing up? I just pull it out. So I'm probably going to wear the rest of these that are up until like tomorrow. But this is how they come out. And I'm probably going to keep it styled like this for a little minute until it gets to the point where, like, it's frizzy. And then I'll kind of moisturize it, then unravel it a little bit and wear it like so. It's been raining a lot lately because, as I stated in the first video, it is hurricane season here. So I'll probably wear this do like this for a little while. But I just wanted to... Come give an update on how it turned out. It turned out really good. Um, but not to toot my own horn. My Bantus always turn out really good. I've been doing Bantu knots. <sighs> I think I stated in the first video. I've been doing Bantu knots since 2012. It's been seven years. I love this style. And it's very easy to do. It's not a really, really hard style to do. Um, so make sure you check out part one of this video. Of course, you're checking out this video now. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe my channel, my page, my videos. Thank you for your support. Thank you for everyone that is a part of my notifications. And yeah, so I'm probably going to do like a light get ready. Um... And with the help of Fenty today, and I just recently did a, I recently just did a summer 2019 Sephora haul. So when that stuff comes in, I'll do a video on all of that before I use all of the products. Today's look um, will be helped by the Fenty Beauty um mini lip and face it the bomb baby which i think i attempted to do a youtube on this and i ended up taking it down i've just done so many i've, I've done so many like idea videos that didn't go up <laughs> but <laughs> if you've seen this in an earlier video you've seen it in an earlier video or maybe i took the video down who knows but today's look will be brought to you by Fenty Beauty and this is a set I got I don't even know how long ago at this point it was sometimes during 2018 I do know that much um but this set has the kilowatt freestyle highlighter of Hustler Baby Hustler Baby and the gloss bomb, and this is the first one she did. Um, 
trying to get it to focus yes the gloss bomb and i'm probably that's probably all i'm gonna do and as you've seen before i'm using the tardy tar is pro to go i've had this one for a really long time as you can see um and i'm just gonna do like a new eye look maybe some lips and that's it i'm just gonna do something like something like but this is how I usually do my brow if I have a pencil. Not going to do too much because it is late in the evening. And basically when I finish with this video, I'm going to do my workouts. <clears throat> and after I do my workouts, I'm going to do more workouts. <laughs> oh, a couple of cush-ups maybe. Maybe possibly. So, yeah, that's all I'm going to do. And it's just a regular little pencil. I have several, but that's like a go-to for me because it's almost gone. And the other pencils are not almost gone. So, I'm trying to hold on to them. And what I do is I take my spoolie. And I just do that. Just shade it out. Line it up a bit with my nail. And that's it. Like, <laughs> that's it. She's been doing that for a long time, too. Like, I just shade it in a little bit. Get myself right. So, I'm going to go in with the, I think it's still just, ooh. You can't see it. Can't. Still can't see it. Can't see it. But I'm going in with the hype. Going to go in with the hype. And I'm just going to hit up here a little bit. The brow bone area. Get it really nice and crispy. Nice and crispy, darling. Yes, do the other one. And like I said, because I'm not really going anywhere, I'm not going to put any foundation with this look. I'm not. <clears throat> I might put minimum on, but not like a bunch, just a bunch of foundation because I really don't need a lot of foundation. Um... And I tweezed. I love so much little baby hairs out. Okay. So. I was just like, when I read, when I do part two of the Bantu Knot video, um, it's not even going to be a third video. Because I've taken some of them out. And I'm going to leave these up. I'll probably keep it like this. I like how it looks. And it's so bouncy. But I was like, I'm gonna get I'm gonna do a light get ready with me. So what I normally do, and this is my fancy beauty I'm using. I try not to use a lot of it because fancy beauty can tend to look kind of orange on your skin if you use a lot of it. Um so I'm just going to do this and I'm doing that. Just going to get my cheeks a little. My cheeks, other cheek. I'm using one of my foundation brushes from BH Cosmetics. And yeah, I'm just going to kind of do like a light little look. Something light, not a lot, don't need a lot. So I'm just going to kind of do a light look. I think it's all her hair. Just some light. So light. 
so light okay and now what i'm gonna do is go in with my fenty beauty hustler baby killer white hustler baby killer white um i like this one because it's it's champagne-y <laughs> if that's a word or if i just created that it's champagne-y and Unlike the trophy wife, because the trophy wife is just, oh my God. Bling, blow, blur, Gucci voice. And I'm going to get this over here. It's unfocusing. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes when stuff like that happens, I'm like... Do I want to keep that in there? I like keeping it for realism because, you know, I'm on my phone recording. I'm going to get my nose. This area. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. So now that I'm done with that, I'm going to go in with my glass lip balm from fancy beauty as i stated this is the first one that she came out with because now she has a tons of lips a tons of lipsticks tons of lip glosses she has everything now even have she even has a luxury brand clothing line now like i'm just gonna use a little Cause you can OD this too, and it'll be like too much on your face. Today has been a nice Saturday for Florida. It it was really nice today. It really it sprinkled earlier, um, and then it stopped, and we didn't see another drop again. Um, it looks like it's probably going to rain again, just not now, but it was a pretty nice day today. Um, we got a chance to go out to the beach, hung out at Davis, ben <laughs> Ooh. Benty Davis Beach. Okay. So in the midst of me putting that back up, um, the table also I use as my seamstress table for fixing fixing clothes it was about to lean back literally so i had to catch it this video is funny it's a lot of it is a lot of opportunity for me to do a lot of different effects for this video because my phone fell and the table i have this propped up on almost lean back so i'm done with this video officially <laughs> definitely done um thank you guys for tuning in today make sure you like comment and subscribe my channel thank you for your support continue to support um make sure you also check out my website i have a lot of hot gear up sunglasses the bathing suits are coming I have to do my photo shoot for that um, and by the way, if you're in the Tampa area, every Saturday in August and every Saturday in September, I will be putting the dates up um, probably along with a new video. I will be in Ebor at the Ebor Saturday Market with Sheikah Citrix. So make sure you come out because um, I have a lot of stuff on hand that... Sometimes isn't on the website. I've had people to come physically shop with me and they're like, this is not on the website. That's not on. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that's not on the website. It's not. <clears throat> I have so much, like so many personal items, so many wholesale items that aren't on the website. So I said this year, I wanted to be more like in the physical where I'm at festivals and a lot of stuff like that. And I've had two festivals this year already. But with Ebor, I'll be out there every other Saturday towards the end of summer. 
So make sure you come support your girl. Make sure to go down and click on that link, shikacentrics.com, and check out my site. But that is it for today. And I even brought primer in and didn't use the primer. Thank you for coming to watch. And thank you for supporting my brand, myself, everything that is Keisha. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Peace out. Have a good day.